Leo. This reading is for the second half of November. I hope you're doing well. I'm actually filming this video on 11-11, so yeah. This is going to be your angel reading. And if you don't know what 1111 stands for, make sure to uh, Google those numbers. Google those numbers there. Angelic numbers. Okay. What are the messages that we have for Leo for the second part? of November. Okay, we have affirmations for healing the heart. Okay. We have inspiration and courage. Okay, Leo. And at the bottom of the deck, we have imagine and envision. So I think at this time, Leo, I think your dreams, it's, I think you should focus on what your dreams are telling you at this time. What are you envisioning? What are you imagining at this time, Leo? And you have a deep breath. Number seven. And you have, it is what it is, Leo. That is number six. So you have six and seven. So I think that you are you are progressing. At the very bottom you have great and full, number four. Okay, let's get some angel cards. Let's see what the angels have to say to you at this time. What kind of advice is given to you by your angels? Let's see. Oh, that one just flew out. You have Daniel. I am the angel of marriage and I am assisting you right now. Okay, Leo. Some of you may need some assistance in your marriage. Maybe you're going through a tough time. Maybe you have questions that you need answered. Okay, and you also have Francesca. What do you desire right now? Visualize it and it will come about. Negativity will block your progress. Yeah, so that goes along with the uh, imagine and envision. Okay, so yeah, these two cards, they're counterparts. Trying to hold them so you can see. You have these two cards. Imagine. Hmm. Inspiration and courage. What was imagine? Oh, that was at the bottom here. Gotcha. Okay, imagine and envision. Yeah. So yeah, I think angels. The angels are giving you some guidance right now. I think that 
right now you you need to be inspired they're trying to help you through whatever it is that you're feeling and you have Teresa on the bottom so it says time out you've been busy taking care of everyone else's needs but now it's time to stop and take care of yourself yes Leo we always have to time to have to have time to take care of our own needs even though um, you may feel like taking care of your partner's needs or your family's needs are just as important you know if you don't nurture yourself then how good will you be for someone else that's just you have to take time out for yourself as well, Leo. And I think Spirit is letting you know that you need to take a time out. Relax, rejuvenate, maybe meditate on a situation. Okay, you have the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands. You have the Seven of Cups. Move these over. You have the Three of Cups. You have the Ace of Swords. You have the lovers, okay. You have the high priestess. You have the Four of Wands. And you have the Ten of Wands. Okay. And at the very bottom of the deck, you have the Page of Wands. Okay, Leo. So, yeah, I think right now... Right now you're going through some confusion. Um, this confusion may be in love. This confusion may be in the choices that you need to make. But I, I feel right now, Leo, that um, there's a lot of things running through your mind at the moment. And I feel like you're having a hard time shutting those things off. Um, you may have things on your mind. I want to say details details on your mind that are like causing you to take a lot of moments of deep thought I, th I think you're you're very much in your head right now Leo and that could be due to to love maybe it's your partner that you're dealing with or maybe this is something that you are trying to um, imagine being in a relationship but right now I see you as the queen of wands so I see you very passionate very caring very very creative very fiery at this time and I feel like you're going through things. Um, you feel like secrets are being held from you. Or you're holding secrets. But I'm, I'm feeling like... With this High Priestess and this Queen of Wands. I'm just feeling like... These secrets that you're holding on to, 
is kind of taking your confidence. These secrets that, that or maybe these are secrets that need to be revealed. But I feel like you're not being yourself at this moment, Leo. I feel like you are, you're caught up in your emotions at the moment. And I, don't, I feel like you're not trusting yourself in a situation. Um, I do feel like there's things that uh, people that are supporting you in this issue, or maybe there's people that are giving you advice, um, people telling you how you should go about things. I feel like some of those people that are in your circle really don't have the best intentions for you, Leo. Um, I feel like they are kind of jealous of what you are creating. And I don't know why I feel that with this card because that's not what this card means at all. Um, but I'm, I'm feeling like there are people who are getting in the way of your happiness. That's what I'm feeling, Leo. Um, and I, I, I feel like you have the ability to be happy. I, I feel like you have a lot of opportunities to hang out or be with your friends or socialize and I, I, I feel like something is blocking that. I feel like you're being blocked for some reason. But I feel like the whatever it is that this energy is revealing, I feel like you're going to know the truth to the situation. I feel like a lot of this weight is going to be lifted off of you. Um, whatever it is that you're carrying, the secret's going to come out. You're going to receive a lot of clarity and a lot of information coming your way that's going to give you uh, the knowledge and the ability to go ahead and make the decisions that you need to make. Okay, Leo. Wow, okay. Let's see. Let's clarify these. Yeah, because this is... Hmm. Interesting, Leo. This is really interesting. Spirit, can you give me a message for the Seven of Cups, please? What is this Seven of Cups? What is this confusion? Why is Leo... So much in their head. Yeah, the Three of Cups. Okay, you have the Three of Cups again. So I, I definitely feel like there's other people in your head, Leo. I feel like other people are trying to move you to a decision that you're not sure about. Sometimes the advice of others, even though it comes across as being with well intentions, I feel like it's not the right advice for you. Yeah, I'm I'm I think that you should take your time and really think out your situation. With the lovers. You have the Four of Wands and the Nine of Wands. So I feel like whatever the situation is, I feel like you should push forward. You should push forward in this situation. Um, you're going to receive happiness. But it's going to take work. It's going to take work, Leo. This is not going to come without some struggle. But I feel like in the end, in the end of the situation, you're going to find happiness. You have the four of wands twice in this situation. 
Now, if this is not dealing with an, a relationship that you have already, this is dealing with the relationship that you're anticipating on having. This is something, someone that either you're already in a relationship with, or it is someone that you are considering. With the Queen of Wands, you have the Justice card. So, I feel like at this time, you... You have the truth on your side. You know what the truth is. And I, I feel like you're a good person, Leo. I feel like whatever this is, I feel like you can overcome it. With the High Priestess, you have the Ace of Swords again. Yeah, truth. Truth. Is coming out. This sword is going to cut through any lies that's coming your way. You're going to be able to see any misleadings before they even before they even touch you. You're going to see it coming. With the three of cups, you have the five of pentacles. Yeah, these these people that are around you, um, these influences in your circle, they and I okay. I I feel like this may be you in a relationship, and now there's certain people in your circle who feel left out. They're jealous of not being your priority at the moment. That's what I don't want to say. Have you been hanging out with your friends so much or, or have you been spending a lot of time with friends and now you found somebody who, is, who could be a significant other and now they feel left out. They're jealous. They're jealous. They don't want you to have something that they don't have. interesting with the four of wands you have the ace of cups and the knight of pentacles if this is a love interest if this is about a love interest I feel like this person is moving very slow I feel like they want to take it slow or you want to take it slow with this new love. Now you have three aces in this reading already. So this is definitely an, an ability of something new. Something new is coming. You have the Ace of Cups and the Knight of Pentacles. The Knight of Pentacles is actually... Um, a slow moving energy. It's not something that's going to come fast. Um, it's something that's going to take work. I feel like you have to have patience with love. Or your person needs to have patience with you. But I feel like this love interest is moving slow. Okay, with the Ace of Swords, you have the Six of Cups and the Seven of Wands. So yeah, okay. I feel like you're innocent in this situation, but a lot of people are like ganging up on you. They're, you want to make a decision in this situation. You want to give this person a chance. 
but I feel like the people around you are totally against it and you're trying to defend yourself you're trying to defend how it is you feel but Leo you do not have to defend yourself from other people it's your decision Anything that you do is your decision. You should get out of your head and just make your decision. Don't let people get into your head. I want another card for this Four of Cups. Ten of Wands. You have the lovers again. At the bottom you have the world. So this is something that can be a real beautiful event for you. But I, I feel like you have blockers. That's just what I'm going to say. I feel like you have blockers. But I feel like once you get out of your head and once you stop overthinking the situation or stop taking bad advice. A lot of weight is going to be lifted off of your shoulders and you're going to be able to make the right decision in your situation. If this is a love interest that you're looking for or if this is about your marriage or um, about a person that you want to deal with. That's why I feel like your angels are letting you know I am the angel of marriage and I'm here to assist you right now. Listen to your own intuition. Listen to yourself. Listen to your spirit guides. Take time out and really imagine what you would like. Yeah, what you what you do desire right now visualize it and it'll come about negativity will block your progress and I feel like these people that are giving you bad advice or that are coming around are the negativity in this situation very interesting Leo very interesting but See, that's the reason why this, this high priestess is here. It's letting you know that, you know, all advice ain't good advice. The people who are giving you advice may be holding secrets from you. They may be holding something from you that, you know, you're not seeing at the moment. Trust yourself in this situation. The truth is going to come out. The truth will come out, Leo. Let's get another clarifying card to close out this reading. Okay, patience. I accept that everything happens in divine order. Yeah, so have patience with yourself. The decisions that you need to make are going to come. Um, if this is a love interest and they're taking it slow or you're taking it slow, have patience. Whatever this is, it's going to work out. Self-esteem. I possess gifts of the soul and ben that benefit me and others. And you have a regret on the bottom. I know that I cannot change the past. Yeah, so maybe some things that happened to you in the past maybe have kind of led you to this point. But what I want to say, Leo, is be careful who you trust. It's 
Spirit, can I have a message to close up this reading, please? Can I have a message to close up this reading? Okay. Attack, pain, fear, judgment, and any form of separation are merely calls for help. Yeah, maybe you feel... See, I think that's the reason why you have the Six of Cups and the Seven of Wands. You're feeling attacked at the moment. Are you feeling judged? I feel like that's why the Justice card is here as well. And you have, I choose to learn through love. Okay. At the very bottom you have, when I think I've surrendered, I surrender more. Okay, Leo, that is your reading. If this message has resonated with you, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads. Make sure to take a look at your sun, moon, and rising for other messages that may resonate with you at this time. Um... And have a wonderful holiday season, Leo. Many blessings to you. Love and light, Leo.